Now with that new trouble for Robert De Niro, he's being sued by his former assistant for $12 million. And here are the details, Amy. That's right. Good morning, guys. De Niro's former assistant is fighting back after De Niro's company filed a $6 million lawsuit against her in August, alleging she stole money and binge-watched episodes of Friends while she was on the clock. Talking to me? He's been one of Hollywood's most acclaimed actors for decades. Never ride on your friends and always keep your mouth shut. Back in theaters this weekend in The Joker. There's something special about you, Arthur, I can tell. But this morning, Robert De Niro is at the center of another controversy, embroiled in a contentious battle of he said, she said with his former assistant. In a lawsuit filed Thursday, De Niro's former assistant, Graham Chase Robinson, accuses the award-winning actor of harassment and gender discrimination, claiming that over the course of the 11 years she worked for him, De Niro communicated in a hostile, abusive, and intimidating manner, often while he was intoxicated, in which he denigrated, berated, bullied, and hurled expletives at her. Her attorney sharing this voicemail from 2012. How dare you? You're about to be fired. You're history. How dare you disrespect me? How much you did? You gotta be kidding me, you spoiled brat. You. Mr. De Niro made numerous comments to Miss Robinson that were vulgar or inappropriate. He joked to her about his Viagra prescription. She claims the film star treated her as an office wife, subjecting her to unwanted physical contact, forcing her to perform domestic tasks like scratching his back and buttoning his shirts. Robinson's suit comes from more than a month after De Niro's company first sued her for $6 million, claiming the now 37-year-old misappropriated hundreds of thousands of dollars of company funds, millions of frequent flyer miles for her personal use, and loafed during work hours, binge-watching astounding hours of TV shows on Netflix. Now, Robinson's team denies all the claims in De Niro's company's lawsuit, alleging it was meant to intimidate her after her attorney warned De Niro's lawyer that she was going to be making legal claims, including discrimination. De Niro calls all of her allegations beyond absurd. But uh, anyway, all the dirty laundry Yikes. being aired Quite publicly. Literally. All right. Thank you, Amy. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.